New details are emerging tonight about the four people killed in a Tuolumne County plane crash. That crash and fire happened yesterday at Columbia Airport. And while investigators are still putting together what happened, friends of those killed are grieving together. Thanks for joining us. I'm Christina James. And I'm Tony Lopez. Thanks for joining us for this abbreviated version of our newscast. New tonight, CBS 13's Drew Bollea spoke with some of those friends and has a story you'll see only on CBS 13. What a loss it is for everybody to not have Claude and Mary anymore. Emotions still raw for Pamela Blair. Her friends died in a plane crash in Tuolumne yesterday. They were quiet and um, caring people who were very involved in the community. A relative tells us Mary and Claude Chandler were in the Cessna 310 with her son Daniel Kurtzfeld and his wife Kristen when it crashed at the Columbia Airport. Everyone on board died. FAA records show the plane was registered to Daniel. Federal investigators haven't confirmed the identities. What a hole in the heart of the community to lose Mary and Claude. Today, friends of Mary and Claude got together to grieve and remember the good times. Those beautiful dinners that we had. They described the couple as having a deep love for the outdoors and, more importantly, their family. They didn't take, take life for granted. They just really lived and did things. The group began meeting as part of a book club a decade ago. They had a lot of insights, they shared their own personal experiences. They listened well in the group. Mary worked at the Historical Museum, and she and Claude raised animals. The Mary was this amazing carver of wood animals. The good times, easy to talk about. The reality that their friends are gone. They'll be missed. Tougher to grasp. And luckily they were together when, when it happened. Federal investigators spent the day here at Columbia Airport picking up evidence. They'll be back out here tomorrow trying to figure out why that small plane went down. True, thanks. Many lives are being impacted by this tragedy. We're told Daniel and his wife Kristen have three children ages 10, 12, and 18. The 18-year-old is a track star at Stanislaus State University.